Hi, I'm Clarissa from Our Doctor. Today we are talking about the meaning of STDs and the importance of tackling an outbreak. The term sexually transmitted disease or sexually transmitted infections refers to several diseases that can spread through sexual contact such as vaginal, oral, and anal sex. However, they can occasionally get distributed through other forms of close physical contact such as skin contact as is the case for herpes and HPV, pregnancy, childbirth, or the exchange of blood or needles between individuals. Three main microorganisms can cause sexually transmitted diseases, bacteria, viruses, and fungi. Genital herpes, gonorrhea, syphilis, chlamydia, HPV, trichomonas, pubic lice, genital warts, and scabies are common STDs and STIs. What about HIV or AIDS? People infected with HIV can expect to live long and healthy lives thanks to advances in medical care. But if the virus is not treated, AIDS can develop, making the body extremely susceptible to other infections and diseases. Additionally, without treatment, a person only has a three-year life expectancy due to the wide range of conditions they are susceptible to contracting due to their severely compromised immune system. Unfortunately, there is currently no cure for AIDS. Anyone who engages in unprotected sexual activity runs the risk of contracting an STD. Condom or dental dam are a good way to avoid infection if they are used correctly and consistently. You also increase your vulnerability to sexually transmitted diseases by having multiple partners. I urge those who are sexually active to discuss their STD risk with their doctor and be tested if necessary, given that many STDs do not typically cause symptoms. Some STDs can be identified through a simple physical examination, while others require blood tests and the collection and microscopic analysis of a vaginal, penile, or anus fluid sample. Even if you do not experience any symptoms once infected, you are contagious. It's important to catch it early and get it under control. The CDC estimates about 20 million new STI cases every year. According to the American Sexual Health Association, about half of all sexually active teens and adults will contract an STD by the time they reach 25. 25! Unlike COVID-19 or chickenpox, your body doesn't develop immunities to STIs. So if you had it or have it, yes, you can get it again. Although both genders are susceptible to STDs, women are more likely to experience serious health consequences due to our anatomy, cultural roles, complications, or even birth control types. Infection with an STD during pregnancy can be very dangerous for the developing fetus. We ladies should therefore increase the frequency of our screenings. Check with your healthcare provider to see if your STD is curable or chronic and get it under control quickly. When it comes to sexually transmitted diseases, prevention is vital. We must raise awareness about this topic so people can practice safe sex, whether it's a new partner or multiple partners. The consequences of unsafe sexual behavior can last a lifetime. So it's essential to have open and honest communication with your partner before getting intimate. And if there is any doubt, get tested. Our doctor recommends using an at-home testing kit. The test ships directly to your door and you receive your results online within a few days. All your information is confidential and instructions are included with each testing kit. If you feel you have an STD or STI or you want to talk to a physician about your condition, don't hesitate to contact us at our doctor. We're here to help. Be safe, everyone.